Good evening, welcome to Youth News Europe. I'm Laura and here at News Rachel. Tonight on Youth News Europe we will be discussing the impact of the EU on our community. Now we are going to switch over to Esther Jane Erica out on the streets who are interviewing members of the local community. Hi, this is Esther Johnson and Erica Whelan for Youth News Europe. We are here with Miss Collins out of St Dominic's Valley Farm to ask her a few questions. Miss Collins, do you feel European? Yes, I definitely feel European. Do you know any projects from the body EU in your community? Um, over where I live in Limerick there is a place called Locker and Locker Development was funded by EU, EU grants. Can you name at least one European MEP from your country? I can. Um, Brian Crowley MEP, good friends of my father so I know him well. Thank you very much for your no time. This is Esther and Erica for you News Europe. Your concern, our focus. We saw about 50 people and we asked them, do you feel European? 22 said yes, 18 said no, and 10 were unsure. We then asked, do you know any projects funded by the EU in your town? 40 said no, and 10 said yes. We then asked, can you name at least one Irish MEP? 13 said yes, and 27 said no. You, you.